All right, so in this video, I'm gonna solve the equation nine to the power of x is equal to 36. So to solve this equation, I'm gonna first start by taking the log on both sides. So I get log of nine to the power of x is equal to log of 36. Now, if I have something in the form log a to the power of b, I can move this exponent b to the front, so this turns into b times log a. In this case, I have log 9 to the power of x, and I can move x to the front, so I get x times log 9 is equal to log 36. And from here, I can divide both sides by log 9. So these two cancel out, and I get x is equal to log 36 over log 9. Now, I'm gonna rewrite log 36 as log of nine times four. So I did this because I can use the property log of a times b is equal to log a plus log b. This case, this turns into log nine plus log four, and I have this over log nine. So now this is equal to log nine over log nine plus log four over log nine, which is equal to one plus log of two squared over log of three squared. And if I have something in the form log of a to the power of b, I can move this exponent b to the front, so this turns into b times log a. In this case, I can move two to the front over here, two to the front over here, so I get x is equal to one plus two times log two over two times log three. From here, I can cancel out these two twos. So I get x equals one plus log two over log three. Now log two is equal to 0 0.3010 and log 3 is equal to 0 0.4771 so if i divide these two i get x equals 1 plus 0 0.6309 meaning x is equal to 1.6309 so this is my answer All right, so in this video, I'm gonna solve the equation three to the power of x is equal to 15. So my only variable in this equation is x, so that's what I'm gonna be solving for. And now for my solution. So let me first start by rewriting my equation down here. So three to the power of x is equal to 15. And 15, I can rewrite this as three times five. And now I'm gonna take the log on both sides. So I get log of three to the power of x is equal to log of three times five. And if I have something in form log a times b, this is equal to log a plus log b. So log of three to the power of x, this is equal to log of three plus log five. And if I have something form log a to the power of b, I can move the b to the front, so I get b times log a. So log three to the power of x, I can move this to the front, and I get x times log three is equal to log three plus log five. So 
So now from here, I'm going to divide both sides by log 3. So for my left hand side, these two cancel out. And for my right hand side, I get x is equal to log 3 plus log 5 over log 3. And this is the same thing as log 3 over log 3 plus log 5 over log 3. So log 3 and log 3, these two cancel out. So I get x is equal to 1 plus log 5 over log 3. Now, log 5 is equal to 0 0.6990. And log 3 is equal to 0 0.4771. So this is going to equal 1 plus 0 0.6990 over 0 0.4771. <clears throat> Now, 0 0.6990 over 0 0.4771 is equal to 1.4851. And 1 plus 1.4851 is equal to 2.4851. So this is my value of x. Now, make sure to subscribe and leave a like. And thank you. Bye.